50 year old taxi driver among two held as cop sees firearm and ammunition. Ladies and gentlemen, be a be a sitting a going now. Whole heap of guns taken off the streets. I am so happy. Viewers and sub, two men held as cop sees stolen fridge in back of a AD wagon. Police are whole on for the boy. The criminal them get taken off of the streets. Ooh, Love yeah. what going on. It's the last year I know. Uh -huh. Uh, 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 uh. things, they have to make a statement If I know bag of things, TV, it don't make sense A bag of things, TV, I run things all the time Bag of things, they have to make a statement If I know bag of things, TV, it don't make sense A bag of things, TV, I run things all the time Bag of things, TV big up on the shelves, no man Everybody TV. large up, no man I don't know say a bag of things made a TV Viewers and subscribers, investigators attached to Kingston Eastern Police Division sees one Pietro Berita .38 revolver and 8.38 rounds of ammunition during an operation on Michael Manley Boulevard in the parish on Thursday, October the 17th. Yeah, man. The police have launched a serious attack, serious spot check. They're checking from left to right. And by doing so, they're reaping success. Here who they charge now? Here dirty nigga now. Cause big man in you know, a 15 inch boss. So I said better example than this. 50 year old man supposed to do something better with his life, you know. You understand what I say? A 50 year old man not supposed to look for go to jail right now. You supposed to look for come from jail. Saying? Charge our 50 year old Winston Bailey. A taxi operator of Glass Pole Avenue, Kingston 2. And 31 year old Richard Edwards, otherwise called Richie, a carpenter of Vernon Avenue, Kingston 3. Mm -hmm. Reports from Elliston police are that about 1.50 pm, lawmen were conducting a vehicular checkpoint, VCP, when a Nissan AD wagon was signal to stop the police them tell him to stop stop the vehicle the driver complied a search was conducted and the firearm and ammunition were seized yes no man yes no man yes no man two dirty niggas that occupied the vehicle were taken into custody mm -hmm. what you mean that's what i talk about get them out of the vehicle and lock them up see some of them money freedom will be taken away from them you now some of them now belong for the streets. I like what I go on. Big up my officer them. Big up my soldier them. Big up the citizens them where I run information for the police them. Now the second incident. Two men held as cops see stolen fridge in the back of a AD wagon. Boy, they my thief, they my thief on a cell. Let me tell you what they aim for. They aiming for poker box, ATM machine, anything with a value. The motif, fridge, stove, washing machine, dryer, anything you can get. See? You don't have to watch yourself. Viewers and sub. The criminal them are desperate because you know. It has come down now, you know, to Christmas, you know. So you don't have to watch yourself more and more. When we say more and more, you have to watch yourself more and more, you know. When it coming down to Christmas time, the robbery spree I got turned up, you know. I want you guys to know that, you know. Remember good, you know. The robbery spray, I got turn up. You can't leave nothing outside. They might go broke into your house if you're not grilling up. You need cameras too. And you need some, some mongrel dog. Feed them on ton carmel and chicken back. See? Even though Mr. Man will love ton carmel and chicken back to see away with some coconut milk tonight. But at the same time, you have to give the dog them what they want. You are going now. Detectives attached to the Mapen Criminal Investigation Branch, CIB. I've charged two dirty nigger with receiving stolen property and housebreaking and larceny. This is what I say. In relation to an incident that occurred in Artwell Gardens, Maypen, in the parish on Thursday, October the 15th, the boy, them are broke in a house, them are broke people's shop, them are broke people's kitchen. They are 22 year old Christoph Scott, otherwise called Breda, a construction worker. And 29 year old Romario Chantilou, otherwise called Kangaroo, 
both have hazard drive maple and clarindon reports from the llama on them are that during an operation carried out on the date mentioned above a nissan ad wagon driven by chantilu with scott as a passenger was driving along the roadway in artwell gardens boy them are pro the street you know he was signaled to stop he complied a search of the vehicle was conducted during the search a refrigerator valued approximately 246,000 Jamaican dollar was seen in the back of the motor car. A surfrigen dear man. Oh, bad star. I can't believe a surfrigen dear in Jamaica. I'm frightened. It sounds like I want to carry this. Somebody buy. One fridge cost 246,000 dollar. Right now, it looks like it's cheaper if you buy an igloo and put ice in it and put a meat pot. Yo, a surfrigen. The fridge is expensive, no blood clear, I like this. I must compute a fridge. Here we go now. Chanty Lou and Scott were arrested. Further investigation by the lawmen revealed that the refrigerator was reported stolen between August the 30th and August and October the 14th. August the 30th and October the 14th. The men were subsequently charged. A court date for them is being finalized. Charge up them blood clear, yes. Boy, them a thief, you know. The boy, them is a dirty thief, man. That's some expensive thing. Them a thief, you know. Saying, 48 hour curfew imposed in Erie Castle, section of Stony Hill. Lucky diggers. When you see curfew, then drop, you know. If you know, say, place are run away, you know. More than know that, you know. A 48 hour curfew has been imposed in section of Erie Castle Road, Brooks Level Road, and Stony Hill in St. Andrew North. Police Division. The curfew began about 6 p.m. on Friday, October the 18th, and will be remain in effect until 6 p.m. on Sunday, October the 20th. Saying, so the police them are locked down the wall in the area. You know, we want to see it like this. When if remember, God say the place are run away, a whole lot of shot a fire, whole lot of people are get murdered in that place. You know, you understand? So the police them are take measures now. We locked down the Wall Streets, saying, The master during the hours of the curfew, all persons within its boundaries are required to remain in their premises until otherwise authorized by the group commander or the ground commander. So, my advice to you if you don't have to live out on the yard in those areas, please stay away from the streets because I measure the police to take for lock down the place. And get to running for some boy. You see me, I say, because they're searching for guns, rounds, ammunition. They're searching for wanted man, wanted dirty criminals. They're searching for it man, gun man, saying scammers. And all these waste man, they want to get them off the streets. So when I say, when I watch yourself, I know still. You see me, I say, yes, no man. When a member still, the like button, look away. I beg you to touch up the like button, you see me. Touch up the notification bell. Subscribe to the channel right about now. Also, all right, a bag of things media TV, man. Like, share, and subscribe. Up, bag up, of things up, media up, up, TV, up. man. Thank you for watching. Make sure you share it. Make sure you subscribe. Press that notification bell to stay updated, man. Jamaican assassin killing all names. Urban legend. Jackal. Jackal. Out. Out.